What's up everybody? It's your girl Tiffany and Vincent, aka Lady Arabella, and I am finally here for a Bella review. That's right. If you guys are following along on my week of inspiration, um, if you saw the last video, we were with Miss Deshauna Mills of Glam Gloss Kiss at the uh, AZTV studio for the Arizona Daily Mix. And now, got my box, y'all. I've got it. So we're going to see what's inside. So if you want to see what's inside, keep on watching. Alright guys, so these are her gift boxes. Um, she has a special going on right now. I will link it down below. I think she may have like a couple left, but she probably will also be doing another holiday one too as well. Um, this video is not sponsored, but it is one of my clients from the Air Bill of Black Card. But we're going to see what's in the box. So, so many goodies. You know what's really cool? Something smells good. Sorry. That was totally my bad. Something really did smell good. It smells almost like chocolate or something. Oh my god, I love it when makeup smells good. Then I just want to eat it. Um, but what I really love is just like opening up a box and getting stuff. I really don't get a lot of presents, <laughs> so this is kind of like my present. So first what we have in here is a little brush holder that says Glam Gloss Kiss. You probably could use it for like a candle holder. I'm going to use it for a brush holder because I have a ton of makeup brushes and I need something glittery and sparkly and beautiful to go on my countertop with it. So that's what I'm going to use it for, but you probably could use it for whatever. You can use it for a cup, make yourself a cocktail. There you go. So there's that. Then we have in here, I think this is one of those like, like lip, like rejuvenators, like that. There we go. Kind of cool. I've never had one of these, so maybe we'll have to actually open this and do like a review on it so that you guys can see what my lips look like before and after. Because right now we're in Arizona and they're a little dry. A little bit dry, not gonna lie. So, we have a, this right here is a, oh my god, this is what smells good. It's a gloss, guys. This, I think it's a gloss. I think it's like a chapstick. Yeah, it's a chapstick. But it's purple and it smells like grapes. It says, you look great today. That's so cute. It's so cute. Okay, I just want to like... It doesn't taste like grape, but it smells like grape. Only on this channel will I eat the product. <laughs> okay, the next goodie we have in here are some Lash Me Out Lashes. And these ones are that part. I love that. That's so cute. Oh, these are so cute, guys. I don't know if you can see them. I love the packaging. And it's in like a little box that I feel like, how many times have you thought, man, those lashes were so pretty. I can use them one more time. And then you rip them off and you put them somewhere. And then you have one lash that's just missing. Well, now they're in a box and the lid closes. So then you can reuse them. Just wash them up a little bit, reuse them. I feel like these are gonna be cute. I'm gonna definitely do these on my next lookbook so y'all can see what it looks like on my face when I'm modeling. So next, finally we are down to the Glam Goss Kiss lip glosses. I'm excited about this. So one sec, I'm gonna grab a mirror. Alright guys, so before putting them on my face, I'm going to put them on my hand so you guys can see what they look like. Um, so this one is a red, so let's see, and I love this little packaging, look at the little lips on it, that's so cute. And it looks like there's like a shimmer in it, it says high shimmer lip gloss, so let's see. Ooh, boo, oh, okay, yes, yes queen. Look at that, y'all. That is beautiful. Now, for those of you guys that know me or that have watched my channel, you know that I am a sucker for a good red. And this goes on really, really smooth. No chalkiness, no like chunkiness, no nothing. Not even like the gl like the glitter isn't like thick or anything like that in it. So me and a red, 
That's all I need. That's all I need in this world is a good red lip. So this one, okay, so this one is just a shimmer gloss, if you guys can see right there. So that's good too, because literally probably like the only color I really love is a red. I'm a girl. I'm a girl that likes my red lips. So let's try it on my face and let's see what that looks like. Okay, so of course, going in, going in for the real thing. Got a little mirror here, let's see what it looks like. Oh, see this goes on guys, really good. Like to be, a, look there you can already see it. To be just a lip gloss, this has high, high pigment. Like it's not like one that you have to like really, really work at in order to get it to show up like this is high pigment which makes me wonder what her lipsticks are like I mean because if this has this many pigment like it's gonna be cute so let's see let's get it on I was talking while I was doing it so it's all over the place oh my god look at that y'all I am like ready for a night out on the town to live my best life, got the hair, gonna put on the lashes, and I'm gonna be cute. I am going to be cute. So, I mean, it's really, really creamy. It doesn't feel like, I can't feel the glitter. So, one thing that I hate with like a shimmer lip gloss is when you can feel the glitter and it feels like it's gonna cut your lips like all the way off. Like that right there. I don't know why people make stuff like that, but you know, there are those times you gotta go to the dollar store and just make it do what it do. I get that I get that but these ones right here guys are gorgeous so and they feel really really good it feels moisturizing it feels like I put on like a lip like chapstick or like a moisturizer and then put like a lipstick on so to have all that in one Deshana you did that with this formula it's cute it's cute I'm glossy so I suggest you guys check her out. I'm going to put her information down below so that you guys can see her and stay tuned because on Sunday she hit the runway for Showcase of the Arts Fashion Beauty Expo, which if you guys have not seen any of the any of the episodes, make sure you guys take a look. We're going to be starting season two on Sunday, so we're going to have clips of her on the runway and also some interviews with her about the brand and how she came up with the brand and what's her inspiration behind the brand. So, if you guys don't know, quick insert. That's it. Showcase of the Arts Fashion and Beauty Expo 2020 will be coming up May 3rd, and it'll be at the Glendale Civic Center. So, if you need a vendor booth, we have them. If you want some tickets, we have them because you should come shopping, shop local, support local businesses, and their amazing brands. That's all I gotta say. Well, I'm gonna go out because now I feel officially like I'm ready for like a date night and to live my best entire life today. So I'm gonna go do that. Until next time, fly high my bella butterflies.